Hi, good evening, welcome. Hey, hi, good evening. Welcome to Ask Field 1969. And tonight our program uh, is about uh, food photography and moment my excitement. So before I, I start sharing my, my special guest, let's take out our phone and start sharing and like. Like I always believe that a lot of time when you share and like, you can recap again. So same thing again, because today is food photography. You've got friends out there that actually love food, love to cook, love to eat like me. And then I love to cook and eat like, like uh, my, my special guest. He can actually share with them, tag them at the same time so that they will be aware about what is going on and the there will be some takeaway. So to me, constantly, we are always learning. So I always, a lot of time, the Aspia 199, we got a lot of sessions. So whether it's it you learn easy cooking from uh, Wong Si Lai, you learn Korea uh, language from Opa, and just now we just have a Japanese, a Japanese language. Yeah, <laughs> so, so do, do share, do share. Okay? Yeah. So you share already, Christine? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, I think it's about time. I think right. I, I start sharing also. Right. Yes, yes. Hi. I can hear my own voice. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah, okay. Share your notification. Okay, never mind. Share already. Share for you already. Okay. Okay, Ken. So okay. Uh let us welcome again. Welcome everybody to Ask Field 1969. And tonight's sharing session is food photography. And my special guest is actually Christine. So, yes. Hi. Hi. Yes, yes. Good so, evening. So, yes, good evening. So, so uh, interestingly, tonight's session, actually, we, we did plan ahead. And uh, in fact, uh, if uh, Christine not sure, this is the first time in my uh, moments, my admin session, that we have a female guest. And, and thanks to the thought. You know, I started with the thought, the fact that because this month is actually International Women's Day. So that was actually, uh, when I do my planning, I said, how I wish I have a female guest to join me in my photo session. Because the last so many sessions is either myself or a lot of male guests. So this time I have with me is Christine. Okay, yeah, so yeah, everybody welcome her. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. So, so I just do a quick introduction. Actually, uh, Christine actually is a foodie which I get to know her as a foodie itself, and same as also a photographer. And she's also an ex uh, SQ with us. So the key thing along the line that for the mantras that she believe uh, travel and eating is actually is so. So So let, let her introduce herself a bit more to, to let the audience know about you. Ah, uh, me? Yes. <laughs> you made me so nervous <laughs> because it was so last minute. Yes. So, okay, hi, I'm Christine. Um, I love to eat and I love to cook and uh, of course I would like to share my cooking with everybody and because of that I start to uh, enjoy uh, photo taking and uh, slowly I think I started I can't remember I think uh, about five five years ago and okay. then uh, slowly that I improved a lot because uh, I like to uh, also tag other or maybe like IG I like to look at those uh, um, master chef, uh, the way they do their plating, or the way they, uh, how they uh, using uh, colors or using uh, like ingredients, you know, uh, to to make their their dishes are so uh, attractive, appealing, and so um, you know, make you really uh, doing and and you feel like oh, I wish I I I'm there to have that plate of meals, you know. So uh, that. That's why. Yeah. yeah. So in fact, actually, if your audience out there, by a brief description from Christina, you usually feel like very drooling at it. Wow, the food is there, the, the picture, the, the whole ambient, the food. It's really food connect people. And what I understand True. is the fact that if you can actually cook, which you can cook, if you love to eat, at the same time, most of us love to eat. And you can shoot at the same time. Uh, I always feel that by learning how to shoot at the same time and also learn from experience from, uh, of others, you're actually able to appreciate the person that cooked for you or even the person that actually you pay to cook itself. Yeah, so in fact, uh, why I invited Christine actually, besides we love food, 
I also like other people. Okay. From now on, we got people that uh, wow, Terence, Terence Tan. Hi, Terence Tan. Hi. I think should be your friend. Yeah. Oh yes. Yo, yes, yes. Oh, Candy. <laughs> hello, Candy. Hi. Ah, uh, Jeremy. Hello, Alice. Hello. Alice. Hello. Yeah. So there's so many other people coming in. Do 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 continue sharing because food is really important to connect people as well as to mm-hmm. fill our stomach. Yeah. But you can make food to be even more colorful and more interesting. This is the moment. Mm. And and I feel that uh, tonight's uh, sharing session, you can see compared to the previous session, the table there's always food. This time, all, even some audience say, hey, no food uh, today. <laughs> no food. Because Sorry. we want to real inside story. Because we also got feedback that when you, you share one dish, uh, how to cook one, shoot one dish, uh, you need to learn one dish of how the, the thing composition. Yeah. And those who want to understand more about lighting on this, uh, go mm. to the past series. Mm. Go back to Ask Your 1969 again. Look at the past series. There's all, always a lot of some theory and some concept. But tonight is actually more to experiencing, hearing, Christine, food, photography journey. Uh, I think you can look at the slide that, that uh, we, we selected. Okay, this is actually an IG. So IG itself, look at it. It's like, wow, it's so wonderful. It's like a piece of art. So when I uh, catch up with her at the time, well, 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 we met almost like uh, four months ago. Mm-mm. Yeah, actually, it's uh, actually through a friend connection. We say, hey, Woody, we go eat dinner together. We eat Thai food. Then I started realizing, wow, she can eat at the same time she can go. But the picture is getting better and better. I realized that, oh, she's in fact a photographer. But photographer no, is not, not because, really. yeah, not because enjoy. of commercial. <laughs> yeah. I always believe that a lot of people, it's not just about you got a certification, then you actually, you, you earn a living. You become a full-time photographer, you consider a professional photographer. But a photographer can be somebody that loves to shoot pictures. Mm. Right, Christine? Yeah. Yes. I so, love beautiful things. Love beautiful I think all <laughs> I love beautiful And we love beautiful food also. Yes. Yeah, I think from a picture, you can, you can tell really it's very, very beautiful. <laughs> Thank yeah. you. So I think the, the journey, which I think the audience out there, we really want to understand how is actually uh, you picked up and why you picked up photography at the same time. And because I believe that your as stewardess itself, right? You travel around the world. Mm. So food is must have tried a lot of different food, right? Yeah, of course, of course. Yeah. And and that's why I as especially, you know, um some restaurants they really um it's a dish, but they're able to make it so appealing, so so beautiful. So you make your really like appetizing. Uh, yes, yeah. and yeah, yeah. and you, you really like oh worth to pay this this uh i mean the the value is like okay even though it's very expensive but it's okay because it, it's like like people when go to nice nice place yes. they always say i i g or, or i g is cheaper. ah, ah yes, yes 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 <laughs> <laughs> so so there's a chef out there really we, as a foodie we really appreciate all your cooking and it's a lot of time the simple plating may appear to other people but to what every single detail is really is all your effort and like, like what Christine mentioned, you travel around the world, it's like every restaurant, every even uh, mm. people that cook, they really put in a lot of effort. Correct. Yeah, Correct. and really it enhanced the picture, enhanced the food, yes. even so, right? yes. so the course. color play a part, right? Of course. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so so the next slide uh, that actually is, is uh, all of us are talking about how we actually go into photography mm. and uh, the journey. So uh, you can look at the next slide. Uh, can also target the slide. Uh, it's actually you can see it's very interesting where uh, me trying to understand Christine earlier, I actually go to an IG because in, in fact, no social media. You want to see a person lifestyle is you got life or you got lifestyle. You look at IG or you look at look at Facebook. So I really look at her face uh, uh, Facebook and IG. I realized that oh, she only started taking pictures. Uh, food photography only two zero one seven. Is it correct, Christine? Yes. Yeah, what, what started so late? Uh. <laughs> because two zero one seven. It, oh, oh yes, yes, yes. That's why you got smartphone. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> I think a lot of times that uh, even me as a photographer, is that a lot of times we miss that moment because we say, I yeah, never bring that big camera. Mm. Uh, yeah, then it's just too bulky to bring around. But really, thanks to the uh, smartphone, smartphone mm-hmm. is the best camera in, in uh, daily life. Is actually our phone. It's yeah. always with you. So yeah. it's actually it's very convenient. And, and now all the apps are good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you can do some editing on the yeah. phone. So <laughs> really good. Yeah. yeah, so so, nice. so when you travel itself, your phone, you shoot, it's so so easy. Yeah. So in 2017, uh can can share you, you started IG. That, that, that that's the point, right? Uh, Something like that. I think 
Yes, you don't want to say yes, you don't want to stop putting it. Yes. Okay, yeah, okay. Just, you know, trying to be keeps <laughs> <laughs> because everybody have an so I we just talked about it before that. I was like, mm. you don't never go live, huh? Yeah. Uh, your life doesn't come alive, yeah. and your business will not go alive at the same time. So good to actually know about live, Zipo. Mm -hmm. It's like whether you're you're selling, but it's about sharing. Mm -hmm. It's about you know, it's about sharing experience. True. So from the the slide that I can see is actually her journey. It's very interesting. Yeah. Uh, she, she she highlight the fact that camera eat first. <laughs> so me as a yeah. foodie, as a photographer, same thing again, and the majority of Correct. Everybody do that. Everybody okay, do that. Take the, 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 the photo. Correct. Yeah. But after, you know, last time I used to like put all the photo into one frame and to show that uh, these are the food that I eat. Okay. And, but after a while, I like, mm, it, it, it's nice, but there's no focus on the photos. So yeah. I, start to, I start to change the. Uh, uh, yeah. way of taking it and also like just put one at least a, I have a story to tell That's actually very interesting comment yeah. uh, in fact I have this this uh, uh, issue in the first place mm -hmm. the same, same, same audience out there to today hearing actually, all these are our experience uh, mm -hmm. you can actually cut out your learning curve same thing again uh, even as far back as even last year or even beginning of this year mm -hmm. last year last year I still believe in consolidated you know, until my business uh, mentor that tell me the LD See, uh, we can say, uh, less is more. Mm. Then where is the chong tian? So to me, at the point, similar to Christine, all very excited. We go to one restaurant. Yeah. We got we got ten dishes. We shoot ten dishes. Yeah, I want to show the whole. world. I show the whole world. This is what we eat. Yeah. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> everything at post. Yeah. So, so like, like what the slide mentioned, uh, camera comfort. The more, the merrier. Yeah. So we're very proud that wow, we got so many food. Uh, we put everything. Correct. Right. But but after a while, you feel that you actually lost the focus. Uh. it's mm. like what is the key food? True, true. So 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 this is a good point as an audience itself. So every time you go to a, a new places to shoot, focus on one one food that actually you feel is very meaningful. Uh, something very palatable that you want to capture and just shoot one picture first. We can save another picture later on, but don't post together and consolidate into one true. one mess. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it wasted the, the effort itself. Mm -hmm. Okay. The next slide I can see uh, is it, very interesting. I, I in this journey, uh, we see transformation. Correct. True, I, true. I see your transformation. Yeah. You see, yeah. What what trigger? What but, but also because I live alone, I only cook one dish. Uh. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only one. Ah, Christy is a very independent woman. <laughs> so woman rule the world. <laughs> so she has same time, she, uh, as much as one person cook. So a lot of times say one person cook, ah yeah, chin cook you cook instant noodle lah, you cook la, or you don't even eat you tapao. But she make the effort to cook. So I can, can all, all the audience can can see from that that slide itself right that she actually share huh? the consolidated. Eventually she go to less is more. So as a person viewing her IG itself right, in fact it is pretty uh decent to look at it. That one picture, mm. I know that you got uh omelette, got this scrambled egg something like that. Then the next one actually even at home <laughs> this, this picture is at home right yes yes. okay yes. this is actually the food right yeah yeah the time i'm still not really sh uh, know how to use the camera especially like the, the shadow side and the light the lighting uh you know you can see the 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 scrub the breakfast yep, yep. because that time the site was very messy okay so i'm trying to focus on uh the, the center part but but when the picture come out yes uh i can't see the the messy part but also there's no focus and there's no story to tell here yep but come to this one uh the color is very dull because i'm i still don't know how to use the lighting at that time yep. so um yeah so it's not so good actually <laughs> it's very interesting to, to hear christine confession time it's like last time people do not know make uh, they put the eyebrow very thick uh. yeah, then yeah. They look back look back the picture that wow last time i don't know makeup now <laughs> actually my eyebrow better my, my control better. Same thing again, photography is that like you look at your past pictures and say, wow, now you can start commenting. But at that point, I say it's the best, correct? Of course, of course. Yeah. <laughs> so, British, man. Yeah. So, so I can see that similar to a lot of us out there, uh, actually, you, you shoot pictures, mm -hmm. you, you can constantly improve yes. by looking. So maybe ask yourself, is like, how do you improve at the point in time? You will know that there's mm -hmm. something you need to, to move on to get it better. What do you do? Actually, uh, it started from, I love to look at the cookbook. 
Okay, okay, okay. Shy, shy. Okay, okay. Cookbook, yes, yes, yes. So, so in a cookbook, normally they have a lot of beautiful pictures. So yes. from there, I start to see that how the photographer focus on the in, uh, how they focus on the the dish. You know, mm. um, some like uh, soup. They will not take the whole picture. Normally, they focus on the the color. Uh, they more focus on ingredient, but some they prefer uh, using colors. So that so that that is how I learn from all. So this. so the key thing actually, in fact, you you don't just blindly try try yeah. try. You actually learn from the right right uh, source. Mm -hmm. So you you actually instead of looking at uh, entertainment magazine, you look at food magazine, cookbook, cookbook. cookbook. <laughs> so you actually shoot in the right angle along so you learn at the same time yeah i i'm, I'm still learning anyway it's interesting we got so many so many people coming in already i can even see your uh uh cindy on cindy on actually in fact she, she actually learned all the session before ah. and in fact she get better and better wow. even got people invite her to actually sponsor some some food food uh uh sponsorship to ask her to take some picture itself Hi. so i can see wow your, your friend is it hi karen Ka karen oh Hello. karen you are so talented wow oh, thank you thank <laughs> so, you so, so sweet yeah i think she got more more than this she, she, oh. she can do a lot of things she's so talented <laughs> i also believe yeah yeah so the next journey i can see that okay all these are uh, from less is more uh, it's from 2017 then after 2017 itself to the year end uh, she is still improving then the next slide i can see that uh this is where she is at the moment or oh, even not really is this was actually in 2018 so still so, not so good yeah so yeah, yeah well, i feel so confident <laughs> so, when, so when, when i look at the transition uh, as a photographer as a foodie itself right i appreciate the 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 small detail that she put in effort to improve so from 2017 2018 i can see wow this picture really different what what, what in the first place uh, can you share with the audience uh, yeah how you take this picture what makes it into you home cook one right then home cook right? <laughs> no 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 this is not this is from cape the, town uh, is it, cape uh, kudu uh, hotel which is in, in uh, africa uh, not cape town no, right no cape um kudu. Uh, sorry one of the island in thailand oh in thailand, <laughs> in thailand. i see okay yes, wow yes. Uh, this is in the uh, hotel restaurant okay uh this is a thai uh, uh something like a laksa but it's uh, with a bit of thai tom yum kind of Case, but I, I realized that the soup because of the lighting still not good enough but yep. the focus is nice but the yes. lighting is not good enough so you can't really see the base with the soup but it's a it's a very good improvement from the uh, yeah the compared, earlier portion even the yeah. one that is actually as far as <laughs> near improved, you know, yeah. yeah it's still a lot of room but to I, I like I like the fact that you mm. even try through the chong tian yeah. which is uh, uh the the noodle itself then the the, focus, the lobster yeah. the, the crab yeah, yeah. I, I like and I'll go back to basic less is more so mm -hmm. it's so much focus imagine you want to capture true, everything true. you capture the whole whole thailand uh, the whole island uh, then capture everything <laughs> <laughs> for the kitchen uh, then the picture is like hey, where's the tong so uh, yeah. i really like this picture i okay. can see uh, the big, big transformation <laughs> so in the guests out there uh, your audience out there you got any any question <laughs> just, just share in the, uh, the comment and uh christine will have to actually answer <laughs> yeah okay next one okay this one also very interesting this one i, I picked one i picked one i built, i also want to know the answer okay because when you actually look at the details you say simple food big flavor potato broccoli soup with tofu and lunch meat <laughs> at one glance i look at this uh, when you go to french restaurant go to actually the amor restaurant uh, this is actually it's like a dedicated piece of art <laughs> suddenly got lunch meat <laughs> because my fish got nothing except the lunch meat in the drawer <laughs> so this <laughs> but because I want to create the colors, so that's that's why I was like mm, too plain, just the white and the green. So why not get something on I top see. of it? So that's I a see. clear color. I see. If without the luncher meat, yeah. just the tofu, tofu would be very plain. Uh. Correct. Yeah. So here I'm trying to create some color. Oh, well, guess out there. <laughs> same thing again. Uh. If you really want to make things happen, uh, you'll find whatever way to make it better. So the, the key thing actually, in fact, the luncher meat really can the out to the teeth. Highlight at the right place because without the the lunch meat, the whole thing will be just white and green. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Then True. then then that stroke itself, you 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 learn from some. Uh oh, uh, this one. Premier is... restaurant. Um. Uh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> uh... Yeah. Yeah. So so same thing again. Uh, imagine just a simple home cooked food. It's really you appreciate yourself how you cook, <laughs> but you appreciate putting effort to shoot it nicer. Uh, it's like a piece of art. So when you look at this picture, it's a piece of art because yeah, it's a fusion. 
in the future, nah. Yes, yes. Yeah, Western yes. and luncheon meat. <laughs> Yeah, also can, Tofu, uh, Asian no. one. yeah, yeah, Asian. <laughs> Very interesting. No, because I also some, create some like protein in this soup, so that that's why that tofu is in there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, talk, talking about uh protein, uh, see, imagine we are foodie, but we doesn't look like we are foodie, right? <laughs> <laughs> Our size is actually quite well maintained. <laughs> so we believe we are what we eat. <laughs> All right. Okay. Next one. Oh, sorry. Yeah. This is so funny. <laughs> this is also very funny. Like, I look at it like, yeah. I think in my mind, how come the fish put on top one? How uh-huh. the fish look so weird on top? It's like, then, then what's the muddy, muddy, purple, pink color thing without reading? Yeah, so this one I must ask you. Yeah. Okay. What, what, why why you, you come out this layout, this picture itself and, yeah, and the, the, the whole food, how you created it? <laughs> I... <laughs> I don't know how to explain <laughs> this, but because I'm trying to create a height, so that's why this angle I take from the side, not on the top. Yeah. Oh. Um. But um. Very iconic, uh. But uh, because I also want to create different colors, you know, like paint the darker color at the bottom, and then some brownish, and then the white on top. Yeah. Oh, oh, so so because you want to have the layer. The layer. That's, that's why, why you I put the fish on top, <laughs> not flatten the, the fish no. like that. Oh, yeah. At one glance, I still thought it looked like MBS, right? You are right. You are right. <laughs> I thought <laughs> the iconic MBS on, on top, ah. <laughs> then below the three pillar, yeah. <laughs> then the money thing is, is the the river, the sea. Mm, yeah, Singapore Sea. <laughs> uh, it don't can be the iconic for MBS. <laughs> no, it look, it look like the Singapore yeah, island. Iconic, ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. But, but the interesting part is actually it's the layer that you want to create. Yes, uh. the layer, the height, and the colors. For, for a person that don't really cook, uh, they, they can't imagine carrot is this color. Uh, this is the purple carrot. So so you when you think through this food itself, you already have the concept of how it lay out. Then you actually uh, come out the picture itself or you... you, you what, what's the thinking process? Well, I think a lot of audience out there really also want to learn if they want to cook. How do they stack up? How do they lay? How do they... Before they shoot? Uh, this one, um, I, I think it's because I only have this ingredient in my fridge, so so I cannot uh, explain. But at later part, I, I will have some photo that show that uh, when you cook or when you want to take a very nice photo of your cooking, always remember to create colors. Colors. Use, yes, create yes. colors. Yes, I, I think colors really play a part. So yeah. uh, we always say, if pictures cannot smell, yeah. it's the color Mm. and the composition mm. to, to make it stand out. Okay. In fact, uh, just to share, we, we have our own uh, Ask Pio 1969. Uh, there's a couple that actually just started first week. Uh, they mm. call it color, Colorful Palette. Ah. So they believe that all the food can be colorful one. Yeah, yeah. So actually this is also, different yeah. Colors, it, it, different colors, different kind of vitamins. Yeah, different like, vitamins. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Wow. Mm. Interesting. Okay. okay, next one. Uh, wow, this one very interesting also. Is that one glance I thought is the, 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 the lines. Uh, you remind me like, like Sotong. Yes, yes. <laughs> Actually, I created this dish is because I have a, a, a vegetarian friend. Uh, oh. So I was thinking that maybe I create a one uh, a, um, vegetarian appetizer. So, but uh, I think that uh, you want to make it not just like boring, like vegetarian. So I make the this, uh, uh, how do you call it? Uh, <laughs> the mushroom, like the uh, cut, the way that I cut, make it like, a, you know, sweet. Right, so right, right. you look... Uh, yes. nicer yes. also when the you take photos at time you can see the line also bring up the photo why why you should at this angle instead of a uh, side view mm, uh okay. the, the the even the the plane but because this foot uh the uh, presentation is flat so there is no height there for you to take sideway so then you have to create your uh your plating uh you have to be uh, more uh so round and also like more center in Let's say the plate in make it in the center mm. and then make it round. You can make it a side or whatever, but but because this dish bottom is uh is in a pineapple. Pineapple. Yeah. Oh. Uh, it's pineapple, so that's why it's round. Mm. Yeah. So that's why take from the top will be nicer than take from the uh side. Way. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. In mm. fact, uh, at one glance itself, I didn't know it's mushroom. I thought it's some filet, some sotong, uh, yeah. something like that. Yeah. Yeah. The next question I also want to ask, why you crop this way? Oh. Well, a lot of audience will actually, uh, if it's a round, uh, I'll shoot the whole plate. Whole plate. Um, so, is that a, a reason you feel... Uh, I feel that more artistic. Ah, yes, yes. 
<laughs> yes. So imagine your color plus the composition by the right cropping. Uh, yeah. You can make it more artistic. Even the, the small sauce at the side, uh, mm. it makes it encompassing that it curves yes. around the food itself. It makes your eyes focus back to the mm. mushroom. Correct. And the color is not really stand out again. Yeah. And and I, I like the fact that you actually put some, is it parsley or uh dried parsley and also the chili flakes. Mm, so we have some color in the center. Mm. Actually, it's also very interesting because even for uh, mm. ourselves to cook at home, mm. even uh, whatever dishes, you put some garnish on top. Uh. Yeah, garnish yeah. is very important. Yeah, you actually stand out the, the whole color. Mm. Even if you, you cook a simple meal, you put it, give it to somebody, okay. share something, somebody will feel that wow, the effort will still look so much. So much nicer. Yep. Yeah. So mm. so I really like this picture a lot, a lot, a lot. Because the angle, the composition, the food is really and the, the way it cut is really not like mushroom, but really <laughs> nice, really nice. Okay. The next inside, this one was so very interesting. This one I take sideway is because that uh, this is the focus is on what kind of ingredients we we have in this picture. Mm. So if you want to tell people that what kind of uh, ingredients or, or what kind of food you're trying to present. So by side angle, you can see that, you know, the, uh, what, what kind of food you are sh the, trying to show. Mm. So because of this squid, right, this sotong. <laughs> yep. Oh, oh like this is sotong. sotong. Right? Yeah, yeah. you like sotong. <laughs> yeah, I thought it's some sausage. Uh, no. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But, but because I find that the shape, it doesn't look like sotong. But um, because this part of the char grill side, right, it looks nicer. It, it, it will make you feel like very tasty, you know. It, it, sometimes we eat uh, the grilled uh, chicken or grill. You, yep. you always like to eat the char yeah, 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 part, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like eating So that's why I, the anchor I stick here is because of the char part. It's uh, a mm. Plus that I want to share is the cauliflower rice that I use for this dish. I think uh, mm. re really you, you put in a lot of effort. I think for the audience out there, even myself, when I look at it, a lot of times uh, you must look at what is the ingredient. Mm -mm. If you can actually in whatever way to actually bring out the ingredient itself, right? Mm -mm. It's actually it's, it's a science and an art. Mm -mm. So actually layering, staggering, and you know the, the fact that you want to show layer, then you're going to shoot from this 90 de 45 degrees down angle rather than from the top. If from the top itself, you can't show the cauliflower rice. So the color itself also very very interesting and this angle is really re refreshing and, and uh, is it the fact that because the uh, sotong is curved that's uh, why you're right you also make it into like a, a no actually it's because i want to uh the sotong i purposely make it curved to sit on top if i put it flat then you will flatten my cauliflower yeah, right yeah yeah <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and and look at this this angle itself you got you still include some background behind Mm. Instead of you crop all the way, is there a reason to... Okay, for this photo, I, actually I have a problem that day the sunlight was not so good and I do not have all this lighting, so yeah. I have to bring this dish outside the uh, balcony wow. <laughs> to try to get the lighting. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, so the so, tray is that, you know, to move... So you want a nice picture, you must put in some effort, <laughs> to okay? Move the light. Uh, but the same thing again, uh, uh, you go and eat with your dad, your friend, Ideally, they should understand you that uh, just give them one minute, two minutes to do something. You know, your guests are complaining. But I think at least they understand. So at least you make the effort and the picture really turn out different. So a bit of effort is important. So there's some same thing as uh, there's no uh, ugly food. It's only how you actually put in the effort to make it nicer food. Right. Huh? Do they? It, it's just like it, you know you go to some restaurant you have the menu ah menu yes most of the people will not look the the words yes yes they will yes. look at the picture yes, yes, then yes. after that they only will go oh number 13 let me see what is that so yeah, usually yeah, yeah. the photo is the word the you know to, to attract you to attract, what yeah, you want yeah. to eat yeah. it's not so much about the wording totally yeah. agree totally mm -hmm. agree if that's, that's why i go back to basically the less is more focus <laughs> on the the, the the key thing they're going to show and you know they if the picture really stand out actually in fact you are you, you cook for yourself, you actually showcase to other people that some other people also know how to cook. You can share with them the recipe. But if you go eat in the restaurant, at least you appreciate the chef. You appreciate the person that cook. You take a very decent picture, you post really, uh, people also feel, oh, yeah, I must go and try, correct? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Of course, of course. The first yes. thing they say, hey, which restaurant? Which restaurant? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Christine Home. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next one. 
Oh, this one also very interesting. It's like uh, I looking at I look. Well, it's actually a bit close up, uh. And this one is actually more lifestyle also. As a photographer, is look at it. It's actually it's not just cropping, cropping, and there's nothing just to show the 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 food itself. This one there's a lot of background. Is it on purpose? And the second yes. thing actually, uh, this is avocado. I like the texture of the avocado. It looks like a a, a traditional caveman bowl, mm -hmm. but you make it so nice. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, and this dish, um, I have because it's not a big plate. It's just a very small avocado. So this one you really need to focus. Then only you can see what kind of ingredient in inside the the avocado uh, bowl. So that that is why this have to be cut into very small pieces, and then and the the camera have to really focus into the ingredients. So you can see that the side is all blur, right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Mm, mm, that's yeah. how I take this. Jeremy was saying this is a very nice shot, very good shot. Oh, I, I oh, totally really? agree. Yeah. Then the Thank other thing also, you. as a person that uh, if I got on the ingredient, first thing I, I thought I cut the slice. I don't cut the cube. Mm. Why? Why you never think about cutting the slice? Uh, because the bowl is so small. I mean the avocado skin. Because the avocado is, itself is very small. If you cut into slice, then you can't see other ingredients. So you don't have the, the, the layer and the, yes. the structure itself. Unless you, you, it, it, you, you use a plate to, to plate this uh, salad dish. But if you want to use back the avocado skin, so you, you have to cut into very small pieces. Then only you can uh, uh, present that. What kind of ingredients in this small little bowl? Yeah. Well, I can see that well, you also eat healthy. Uh, so I even got people comment, how delicious. <laughs> so are you also very focused in healthy? Mm, yes. So so you Less are carbo. So carbo, <laughs> balance of food at the same yes. time, color at the same time. Colors. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Yep. Interesting. Mm -hmm. ah, this one. <laughs> well, I think uh, the audience out there, I think we already, every picture you were to recall back uh, because you already share and like into your own timeline. Uh. Mm. Go, go through again. But every picture, like Christine share, there's certain things that they take away. So whether is it uh, the composition, the layer, looking at this layer, because you want to see the, the, mm -hmm. the different structure, every picture, there is some learning. Mm -hmm. So same thing again, at this point in time, you want to encourage again, share and tag your friend. Mm -hmm. If you've got friends that actually into food itself or even learn to cook, share with them, tag them at the same time. Mm -hmm. So that Christine sharing uh, will become more people actually aware about it. <laughs> yeah, and today is the first time. <laughs> yeah, very nervous. Very nervous. <laughs> Can't tell, right? <laughs> you know, where's the camera? <laughs> uh, camera is there, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So, so uh, back to this picture. In fact, mm. same thing again. It's really like a piece of art. Imagine, uh, just imagine, you take this picture, you blow up into a square size, like those posters behind. You hang on your wall. You also look so appetizing. Hang on your dining table. You create yourself. You shoot on your handphone. You blow up into poster would be very nice. <laughs> and this is really like a piece of art. Uh, share, share. Why, why, how you come up with this concept and what, what is it about? Uh, for this dish, like I say, sometimes when you uh, wanted to focus the main thing, uh, because if you take 45 degree, let's say, or the side way, you only see the uh, eggplant, but you can't see the, the, the stuff inside. Yeah. Yeah. But then if you want to see the start, uh the 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 side, right? You can't see the pineapple. If you see the pineapple, then you do not know which one is the focus. So from, from the top view, you can see both. And and because of the shape, it's very beautiful, especially the eggplant. Yeah. It's very beautiful. Yeah. It's not those like long type yeah. and, and, and the it it's just uh uh what do you call that? Um uh, just beautiful uh, on the, the shape on the bowl. Oh, no, actually, it's not bowl. Actually, it's a plate. It's a but plate. Because it's a deep dish. There's, there's a, so, a, yes. a hollow inside. Correct. Okay. So, it's a deep dish. That's why when you put it in like that, it, it, and the pineapple hold on to it so it will not topple sideways. Okay, okay. Yeah, so if you take this way, it will be nicer. So, so actually, mm. it's, a, it's a method also. So, imagine yes. you want to support something. Yes. You can put another layer of things that actually is mm. also very stable. Yes. So you choose pineapple, but pineapple is also Actually, in, part, it, of part of the dish really. Uh. Yes, it's yeah, part yeah. of the ingredient. Uh, yeah. mm. I can see some, most of your dish, you actually like you use pineapple. Why? Uh? Antioxidant. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fruits, my, I like to uh, uh. Eat, uh, I mean, put my uh, a lot of dishes, uh, I mean, add uh, fruits into my dishes. Why? 
Because a lot of time when we eat uh, cha sao, uh, the chicken rice, laksa, never think about food into the, the dish. Whether it's laksa, nasi lo, where got food? Uh? Next time my laksa will have uh, like cheese. Wow. <laughs> you know? wow. but, 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 but you feel food is important in the, the stable of the food? Is it? Food, sorry, fruit and food. Yeah. <laughs> because we, we don't, uh, I mean, a lot of times we, we don't have, do not have time. And we uh, like we're trying to eat one dish and that's it. So I'm trying to put like uh, vegetables, fruits, and put all into yeah, yeah. one. So it's like three in one, and you uh, can. Yeah, very good idea. A lot of time in the gym, in fact, we eat eat food outside. Uh, we got no, not enough vegetables, not enough fruits. Yeah. So in fact, you you give a good suggestion to a lot of people that yeah. if they can cook, put everything together. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Wow. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. Ah. Uh, okay. Wow, this should be the, the last last uh, picture that we will be sharing. I think I'm uh, looking at this picture again. Just my imagination. Uh, <laughs> just not to share how you all look at it, the audience. Uh. It looks like a mother uh, holding a baby and the husband is like Gan Chao. Uh, and, uh, oh, don't say the, the husband the, like Gan Chao. Like, husband, <laughs> uh, like two person is like a couple holding a baby. Uh. So that, I thought, is your creation. I thought it's so wonderful that wow, you make the food so nice. Is it I think too much really? <laughs> I actually think too much. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, when I uh, took this photo, uh, uh, I was thinking that um, how, because the ingredients is very little, it's uh, like three pieces of uh, scallops and then a few pieces of the <laughs> broccoli. So, so I was thinking that how to make this dish more um, appealing and more uh, nice. Uh, so I was thinking that can can i get something the flower something like red color but uh, how to get a red uh, yeah. ring <laughs> yeah. i went down to pluck the flower from the garden you pluck from the flower <laughs> from the garden yeah and just put it on so i can see like different color green yellow and so the flower can eat right cannot eat cannot eat uh? sorry <laughs> oh, for the purpose, for the purpose. <laughs> yeah oh so good but this is an effort and, and the kidding the color combination, the yellow, yellow is it the mustard or is it the? Uh, no, uh, is uh, pumpkin. pumpkin puree. Yes. So same thing again. I think mm. a lot of people also at this stage in step, at this point in time, a lot mm. of people will ask, when you cook your dish, mm. you only have uh, visualize how it look like at the end so that you're you're ready for Instagramable picture. No, actually, no. I never think of that. But when I cook, I always like I I I wanted to make my dish very beautiful. So. I will just start to like maybe um put it this way. It actually you my photo I take a few then only uh and then do some editing. Uh uh then only I choose one. It's not that one shot I get a very good photo. Okay. So okay. I have to like from sideways 45 degree, 80 degree, 90 degree top side and then and see which one is the best. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so, so this and then back end uh inside, yeah. Because a lot of time we say, Wow, this picture very nice, huh? Christine might have taken the last 20, 30 shots already. Yeah, yeah, it's just like, you know, for uh, those yeah, modeling. Yeah, modeling. Yeah, 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 I yeah. believe that those cover girls, they have yeah, to take yeah. how many times, you know, to, to get the perfect yeah. look. So, so a- effort is kidding actually, but the the, the better you, you do, the more mm. practice you are, the more anger you know Correct. how to capture it nicer. Yes. So, like last yes. time, maybe you need 50, 50, 50 shots. Uh, now, you cut down to maybe uh, 10. Yeah, about 10. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> And I need to do editing also. Sometimes, you know, some sauce or uh, fingerprint, all this, then I use uh, May tool <laughs> oh. to erase the, uh, yeah, to erase the uh, finger. Uh, uh, no, normally, in, in the most of the, the sharing <laughs> session, I, I use Snapseed. So I tell the audience, hey, Snapseed is actually good, it's free, and actually can do a lot of things. And, and use Snapseed. And actually, for food, for building, for people, May tool to me is actually very female mm. using, and actually, to me too, the Liena. No too makeup, put makeup. Good, yeah. uh, but me too can use for food. Yeah. Wow. Me too can use for food, also can do video editing. Video editing for me yes, too. Yes. Wow, yes. I think God get yes. uh, 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 audience out there live already. I, say, I, yeah, 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 me too. <laughs> yeah. If I go wow. out with my mom, I say, no need to make up. Don't worry. My me too is here. <laughs> <laughs> wow, so now May 2 become can complete everything from food to, to beauty, everything. Yes, yes, wow. yes, yes. Okay, so so the the, the king also the king is about uh small detail. Mm. So see to it just me. So right. imagine she look at all these small, small uh not so perfect things, she actually used May 2 to clone it to add the touch up. Yeah. Yeah. 
So uh, I think that should be all, but just recap again. Uh. So this other picture, transformation, first picture. Okay, this one, to the, to the audience again, as a reminder, whatever in your fridge, add on to the color, but again, it also can be about Western and Eastern. Oh, oh it's a like fusion, interesting. Uh. Next one, actually, in fact, it, it, it's a, whether you create yourself, it's a MBS. This one, one line. One line, yeah. One line, one line. can be creative. <laughs> yet, the, the, yeah, yet, the interesting part to her is that she, she wants to show layer. Mm. Because if the puree itself without the layer and the fish put flat, uh, the whole thing is actually will be, will be, will be not so. To look like sotong, <laughs> to look like something that is not the same, but yet it's like a piece of art. So, same thing again, effort and the cropping. From this picture itself, you have to re recall back again, she mentioned it's about cropping, it's about enhancing the, the right ingredient. Mm. And uh, it may not be a full plate. If a plate is round, you can just cut one, one shot, half of it. Yeah. Yeah. This one, same thing again. Mm. Anything to remind again, this picture? No. But no. lemongrass squid really good. <laughs> lemongrass, right? Squid. Oh, lemongrass. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, because she, she's sweet. talking about food already. Talking okay, about so uh, menu. <laughs> so hungry. <laughs> yeah, so so uh, lemongrass and squid combination, very nice. Okay, this one again, same thing again. Uh, it's about using the, the, the bowl, the avocado become the, the, the bowl itself, the mm, skin. Mm. Yet in the end, to me, if I were to cut the, the julian, slice itself very flat. But putting into cube itself, right, you got structure. And the so, height. Too. And the height. So same thing when, get, when you are doing it at home or go to a restaurant or even tapau. Tapau itself, put into the plate, you can to, to put it into structure. Yep. Same thing again, piece of art. And to get the support on the base to balance something, yeah. you can put something. Some people use bread. Some people use uh, cucumber. But for this but picture, yeah, some chef they try to balance their ice cream. They use the uh, cookies or the cr uh, uh, the cookies crumbs or something yes, yes. To you know, ice cream will not move around. Yes, yes. So so that's also one way to achieve. Yeah. You, you you don't always complain. Every hey, picture can collapse. How the food cannot support? There's mm. also ideas. So mm. pineapple is actually one. This one lastly again same mm -hmm. thing, maximize. Mm. Even though the flower not edible, but in the color, just try it. <laughs> okay, so that should be about all about. Mm -hmm. All the, the six insights that uh, she shared from every single picture and all these are your effort. Thank you. Any other thing to share with the guests? The moment. <laughs> I think the, the key thing actually, from what I see, uh, I think you encourage people to keep shooting, right? Of course, of course. But because your man mantra is actually travel and eating, right? So, so uh, it would be... Now, cannot travel, never oh, mind. cannot travel. We travel at home. <laughs> yes, we can travel at home. Can you actually travel out in Singapore? La. Then use a discovery voucher to travel, but at the same time, can eat at the same time. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah to yeah. support, support yeah. The, the economy. Then you practice the food outside first, then after that, next time you do it. Yeah, get home. some ideas outside yeah. the restaurant and bring it the concept, bring it home. Correct. Yeah. Correct. How to do presentation on your food, then how you can create a very nice uh, photo taking. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Well, I think uh, at least say, uh, learn so much. Less is more. Color <laughs> combination, cut, uh, angle, detail. And mm. at least actually it's our Wong Si Lai, okay? She knows how to cook food uh, in wow. a very fast manner because she, she is always find that why waste your time in the kitchen mm. where you can dress nice nice in the aircon, you can cook faster. <laughs> so yes, again, yeah, imagine right. for her to, to highlight, I think all of us is learning. Mm. I think thank you so much for your, your sharing. You. In fact, uh, I, I always uh, encourage together uh, with you that mm. uh, keep eating. Well, especially your food, food, your foodie, keep shooting, correct? Yes. And stay healthy and stay foodie. Yes. So that's actually to us is it, wrap up for tonight. And uh, anything, just keep your, your comment flowing. Mm -hmm. you let, let's say the next session you want to hear or more angles of pictures or even food, nature, whatever, just, just share. So that can, we can actually prepare and invite the different guests to come in, take a look, then start sharing. So that the, it will be very insightful that while we are learning, at the same time, we're also making our horizon and new skill at the same time. Yep. Yep. True. So, Thanks again to uh, Christine for your time. So uh, we welcome you to come back again and at the same time, uh, continue eating. Yes. yes. <laughs> Say happy. Yes. yes. Okay. That's, thank you everyone to the audience. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> thank you.